Okay, you've decided where to go. You've decided that the moon's out of your way, but now you gotta get rid of those danged clouds. Which hour should you go and will it work? Here are the two websites that I use to check to see if clouds are gonna ruin my Milky Way. Number one, cleardarksky.com. This site is only available for those of us living in North America, Canada, US, Mexico, and Bahamas. You go to clear sky charts. I'm in Utah. I'm gonna go to the list first and show you. Here's a quick way to see everywhere in, in, in Utah and see all the different stations and get the information for their sky charts really fast. So let's go to the map. I was in the salt flats last week, which are over here, and the closest pin is this one in the null. So I'm gonna go to the null clear sky chart. Blue squares are good, white squares are cloudy, and you can see that it's breaking it down hour by hour by hour. All of Tuesday, here's all of Wednesday, and part of Thursday. Cleardarksky.com is fantastically accurate and great because of all the stations that are local right there, and that's why I love using it here in North America, but even though I don't have to use option number two, I always add it because working them in together in tandem is a better way to know for sure whether you should go out. Option number two, clearoutside.com is fantastic and it's for everyone else in the rest of the world. You get more than 48 hours. Click on Tuesday, for instance. Green is great and everything else going towards orangish red is bad. Huge benefit of clearoutside.com is that it breaks it down by elevation, high elevation clouds, middle and low. So you're gonna see if there's a low covering coming towards you or maybe you wanna plan a sunrise where you get that early morning glow before the sunrise happens on those high elevation clouds. It's gonna show you right here. You can see total clouds just like we got in clear dark sky, but you're also getting low clouds, medium and high. Oh, awesome, two o'clock and four o'clock, I'm gonna see an International Space Station fly over. You don't get that information at cleardarksky.com, so it's awesome to work these together and get all that information combined. Thanks guys for watching this video again and coming back. I'm back from the workshops that I was in. I was in Oregon and Salt Flats. Now I'm back in studio finishing up the rest of these videos and I want to thank all of you who joined the Milky Way Photographers Guild. I really appreciate your support and looking forward to hanging out with you and next we're going to talk about planning with photo pills and I'll get that out as soon as possible. Fix. Later on. All right. Okay. Find the sky. Find the sky, Star Landscape Stacker. <gasps> Ooh, it barely missed.